We will now look at the creation of a closed loop circuit. Keep the same proportional value used in the open loop example and introduce a joystick and a control device. Enter identifier for control device. Once again, follow the same linking procedure as for open loop. Enter values for minimum and maximum signal, as well as minimum and maximum force. Then access variable assignment, and this time link input signal to control variable, not to joystick. The last step is to enter the equation into the controller. The equation will be used for the feedback signal. Double click on control device and access the output variable window. Wanting to minimize the error, the equation has to take the position value of the set point device minus the position of the actuator. For example, JY underscore X dash position. The actuator doesn't completely extend or retract once the joystick position is 10 or negative 10. We need to change the characteristic flow curve in the valve. Change the curve to have flow on all positions. We will now see a complete extension and retraction. If value 0 is the halfway position, a value of 5 will be 75% of the extension.